Hello everyone. In this video, we are starting exercise 2.6. In this, in, in this first video, we are going the first three question of this particular exercise. Uh, to solve question number first, uh, we can assume here as one. So simply we can cross multiply. So when this is multiplied by one, it will remain. Sorry, it will remain as it is. And when this is multiplied by two, we'll get six x. So we can simply shift this constant to this side. So this positive will become negative. And when this shifted, this constant to that side will give positive three. So this is two x equals to three. So x would be equals to three upon two. To call to solve question number second again, we have to cross multiply. When this is multiplied by 9 will become 9x and 15 when multiplied by 7 uh, so we have to open this bracket so when 15 multiplied by 7 is 105 and when this multiplied by 6 is equal to 90x here it is 9x so we can simply shift this variable to that side and this constant to this side. When shift this constant is shifted to this side, it will become minus 105 and this would be 90x and this positive when shifted to that side will become negative. So this is 99x and this is 105. So x will be equal to 105 upon 99 and both carrying negative sign. So this can simply be cancelled out and when cancelled by 3 this is 3 times 9 and 1 35 and this is 33 so x will be equal to 35 upon 33 in question number 4 again we have to cross multiply so when 9 is multiplied by z is 9z and 4 multiplied by z plus 15 so this is equal to 4z plus 60 and 9z so this can be simply shifted to this side and positive will become negative this is 5z so z is equal to 60 upon 5 which is equal to 12 so z is equal to 12 here definitely should divide 60 because here it is multiplying z thank you